Yeah, Shane, an emotional meeting was held here at the school tonight. No cameras were allowed inside, but reporters were. These parents are angry and terrified that there may be other children who were abused. For five years, Noah Campbell Halley has been a technology teacher at Stony Brook Elementary. Today, he was charged with sexually molesting two six-year-old boys in a side classroom where students say he never turned on the lights. This mother now worried about her first grade daughter. You know, I'm shaken. I'm shaken that she was in the situation. She was with this man. How can they not know? I mean, the children called it the dark room. I'm horrified. It's emotional. It's draining because you wonder, like, did it happen to my kid? I think everyone has to take a step back and realize that this is a very, very serious investigation with very serious consequences that uh, no one wants to compromise. Tonight, school officials and police admitted it's too soon to know if there were other children victimized. So experts were brought in to advise parents how to look for red flags and talk to their children. There's also a statement made to, the, to at least one of the children along the, uh, you know, threatening him that if he were to report this incident to his family or police that he could get in significant trouble. How surprised were you? Tremendously surprised and, and deeply saddened by this issue. The parents will be getting talking points via email tonight. A team of school psychologists will be on hand starting tomorrow. And very soon, the school board will be taking up whether they can put extra staffing or cameras in the classrooms. We're live in Brewster tonight. I'm Mary Salatna, WCDB News Center 5.